Okay, on this big fence staining job, let's go see what kind of damage I've done. I bought six gallons of Cabot Ultimate Finish. It's called Sunlit Chestnut. It's got a lot of poly polyurethane in it. You can see how shiny this stuff is. That's the urethane. It's called Sunlit Chestnut. Got here at 8. It's exactly 3. Okay. That looks good. All right, I think I've accomplished a lot by uh, getting this uh, this done in eight hours. What do you think, huh? Pretty good job on that little fence. <laughs> I'm only kidding. <laughs> I'm only kidding. <laughs> let's go back here and see the real damage. Come on, let's go. Okay, and I use a three-inch brush. And you can see the before and after. Now the lady who owns this yard approached me this morning and might be wanting to do hers too because the owner, this owner, had not only this side of the fence stained, but he also wanted to not leave this neighbor hanging here. So this is what I did. Let me get this gate open. So I stained her side of the fence. Okay. Hopefully the sunlight's picking this stuff up. Okay. Keeps going. Through the woods. There we go. Okay, so this side of the fence is stained. This is the neighbor's yard. All right, let's go back around. you have to get in all these damn bushes to get back up in there. That is what it is. Okay. This side is stained. This side stained. And also stained this side. These are eight foot sections. So, no, excuse me, ten foot sections. And there's nine of them. So two sides, that's nine, plus nine is 18. 18 times 10 is 180 linear foot, plus these two sections on the other side, plus that small fence up there. So I'm up to almost 195 to 200 linear foot. Yeah, what a big difference. You can see the contrast. Look at that. Versus look at this. Now I just started on this over here. Now of course this thing is 
now the width of the property so I had to go all the way down all the way down there and then all the way across and then I got to stain the other side of the other neighbor's fence but I do not have to stain this guy's side of the fence okay so there we are Bam. This is also the same house that I rebuilt this deck and stained it. Also painted this stamped concrete black. So there's the fence. Keeps going around, keeps going around, keeps going around. Over here. And then stain the other side. I've given myself four days to do all this. But at the speed I'm going... Unless that back one slows me down, that back fence slows me down somehow. I can do 200 linear foot in one day. That's what it boils down to. And that's not stopping, no breaks, no lunch. That's just working that brush. Okay, guys, let me get out of here. You know what to do, comment. So for the last three days, eight hours on Saturday, six hours on Sunday at the land, and now eight hours out here, 16, so 20, 22 hours of stain work that I've done in the last three days. Okay, let's get out of here. And I already told him stuff's going to be real sticky to the touch for several days because of that polyurethane in it but I think it turned out real good uh, the color I love it I really love the color so and I'll be here like I said for another two to three days for sure and then I go to New Bern North Carolina on Friday and help a guy rebuild a house so he can put it up for sale all right guys let me get out of here you know what to do